Welcome, I'm LJ Ravengale, Ravengale Tarot on A1R Psychic Radio. To reach me directly, you can go to ravengale.com, that's R-A-V-E-N-G-A-Y-L-E.com. We are taking live calls as they queue up. I thought we'd do a three-card reading from the Spirit Animal Oracle by Colette Theron reed And in the past position, we have the wombat. Being at home, literally, or metaphorically, being comfortable in your own skin. A reminder to be yourself. And then in the present position, we have canary. Give voice to your spirit and let the world know who you are. And then in the future position, we have wolf. Becoming the person you are fated to be. Embrace and own the lessons of the past. Move it from knowledge to wisdom. So the client has been going through a period of self-discovery. Wombat and cadet, oh my goodness, wombat and canary together emphasize the importance of being comfortable with who they are. Canary says now is the time to step away from being a homebody and go out into the world. Share your song and your joy. Wolf is going to help take that renewed self-awareness to a deeper level, from self-knowledge to moving past lessons learned. The future for the client is going to be about becoming who they came here to be. And so, looking here while we're waiting for our caller, I'll go ahead and pull uh, pull a card for today. Okay, looks like we have a caller coming up. Aguanda in Atlanta. Yeah. Thank you. Hello. Welcome. Hi, how are you? I'm doing great. Uh, how are you, Aguanda? I'm good. I'm good. So how can I help you today? Um, just about life. <laughs> okay. So you're looking for a general reading then? Yes. Okay. Let's see what's going on with the Quanda. Show me what's going on with her. So in the past position here, I've got the Eight of Swords reversed. In the present position, I've got the Three of Swords. And in the future position, I've got the Magician reverse. um, So looking here, it looks like you've been going through some difficulties lately, uh, not uh, and, and really just not feeling like you could move forward with the Eight of Swords. Eight has to do with with balance, and swords has to do with actions taken. Um, the three of swords, three is about partnership, and in this upright position, I would say you've had a broken relationship or a really big disappointment here in the present. And then in the future, you've got the magician reverse, and with the magician reverse, the magician is the one who's capable of using their tools and resources. So let's see what we can do to help get you some tools and resources to move forward and help you feel more empowered with things. Um, Okay. How to improve this situation? What kind of help can she receive to help her move through this? In the past position, I have death. In the present position, I've got temperance reverse, which has you going with things being out of balance. Um, So is this a love relationship that you you took a real hard step back in? Yes. Okay. Um, Looking here at the next series of cards that I put down, death was the death was the death of the relationship, and temperance has to do with things being out of balance. You're trying to make things uh, make two things work that really aren't compatible: fire and water. And then in the future coming up, you've got the nine of cups reversed, and so I'm really 
this has a lot to do with, with some really profound hurt uh, that you're trying to heal through. Um, looking into what serves you with this or what's going to help you with this. I've got the King of Swords reversed with the King of Wands reversed and the Page of or Page of Swords along with the Tower. And that is your whole life is changing for you right now. Um, and so what I'm going to what I'm gonna suggest is you've got the Four of Pentacles also is something that's gonna help you. And with the Four of Pentacles, that has to do with paying attention to your material world, your wealth and your health. And then you've got the Two of Pentacles. So what I'm going to suggest is to go ahead and let your life around you, rebuilding your life, take your attention and help to, and help to be a distraction for you to help you get over this period of profound emotional pain. Um, I wish I knew a better way to say that. It's just I see I, I just see a lot of pain here for you, and I'm not certain how else outside of suggesting that you that you move your move your attention from inward to outward to help you regain your feet and get into a better position. Okay. Um, do you have a Do you have a more specific question for me? Um, I'm, I've been thinking really hard about starting another business, um, okay. just to get my finances together. Okay. That, that makes sense. Let's see what's going to happen with this business. What's going to happen with this business? Okay. So we have you with the Eight of Wands in the past. This is something you've been thinking about for a while now. Um, and then I have you in the present. Yes, this is looking very nice. I have you in the present with the Queen of Wands and the Seven of Swords. And so although you've been thinking about this for a while, you haven't really done a whole lot to, to begin to move this forward. And I'm going to encourage you to do that because in the future we have the Fool, which is great. Because the fool is about the person who, the, the person who is starting something new and able to move forward without the burdens of the past, and really be able to go forward without fresh expectations. So this is a great opportunity for you. And then okay. the other thing that I see supporting you in this, which is interesting, is you've got the lovers card reversed, and this is in the position of support. So you're really going to be able to launch forward from that from that disappointment and move forward into the nine of cups, which is great because it's upright and that is the ultimate happy card for you. So I am really excited. What kind of business is this? Um, I want to do a, um, like a delivery service. I had kind of okay. partnered with my family and it didn't work out as well as I wanted it to. So I kind of want to do something on my own. I really think you should do this. I think this is something that's going to be very successful. But you do need to start taking action and, and take it out of thinking about it and dreaming about it and really begin to pick up your tools. Um, that, that Seven of Swords, I'm going to hold it up so that you can see it later in the, when the video is published. But you have a man just looking at his swords, and those swords are tools. That, that's the, those, okay. those are the tools of his craft. So rather than rather than just looking at them, it's time for you to start doing things. Start start putting your business plan together if you haven't got one already. Start putting things in motion to begin delivering the, to begin this delivery service. I I really think this is going to be successful for you. Okay. Is there another not to be welcome? Is there another question that I can look at for you? Um, I've been having some struggles with my relationship with my uh, children. Okay. Relationship with her children. Relationship with her family. I'm going to put down a fear of flying spread for this and see what we get. How many children do you have? I have two. 
to. Okay. So what's going on with this? With this, with her family, what's going on with this? On one side, I have Columbus, and on the other, I have her family. I would say that your children are really worried about are really worried about the finances um, coming up on their side of the coming up on their side of the spread. Now I see that this is an old that this is with the five of swords. This is this is something that has been uh, going on for a while. Um, and then on their side, I've got the two of pentacles, which has your children worried about the flow of money along with the eight of wands. They've been thinking about things too but they're just not seeing how all this is going to come together. On your side, I've got the Four of Wands reversed, the Eight of Swords, and the Two of Swords. So really, with you, it's going to be all on you to move forward with them on this. Um, I would find a different topic to, to focus on with them because they're, they're done with the topic of, of, uh, of, of the past. They need, uh, you need to open up a new course of discussion. Okay. Um, I've only got a, about a minute left. Um, I can try to hurry through another question if you have one. Okay. Uh, is there anyone else coming? Okay. Somebody else coming for a condo. A new relationship. And I apologize if I've bur- murdered your name. I, I this just so- was... Let's see here. You know, this, this period of healing is not going to be just about this. I have about 30 seconds, so I'm going to be very quick here. This period of healing is not about just this past broken relationship. It's about, it's about other disappointments and hurts that you've had this way. Before you can move forward, you need to heal those. Okay. Is what the, is what the cards are saying. All right. Well, I do want to thank you so much for tuning in and and talking with me today. And um, I do need to say that our time together is coming to an end. For your personal reading, find me at ravengale.com. Until we talk again, may you and yours have the best of happiness.